That particular carousel was built in 1908, has the biggest hand-carved, hand-painted horses of any carousel in the country. Hi, I'm Ariel Kaminer, the New York Times city critic. Pedicabs have been in the news a lot lately. Uh, one of them got in an accident on the Williamsburg Bridge where they're not even supposed to be in the first place. And uh, the city council passed legislation saying that pedicab drivers have to be registered and regulated. You might not know that the pedicab drivers themselves are in favor of the legislation, or at least some of them are. I wanted it years ago. You know, I started this when there was about 75 bikes on the street. How many are there now? Oh, it's got to be over a thousand. Back then, it was very bohemian. It was all artists. We were stationed in Soho. Cops used to like see me pedaling past and they'd joke with me. They'd be like, you can do it. And they'd give me a push. Now, they hate us now. Let's go, man, let's go. It really is very different than riding a bike. And, and for whatever reason, some guys just cannot do it. Like I've trained guys myself in like empty parking lots where there's nothing but a pole and they hit the pole. I realized that after however many years in New York, I'd never ridden in one of these. I'd never even considered it. So I went out to find out if it's just a silly touristic indulgence or if it's something that the rest of us can actually use. Also to find out if one of these guys would possibly let me drive one. You have the classic Main Street here, meant for two people. You have the Broadway over here for three people. And then you have the boardwalks that usually fits three. Everyone likes to tour through the park, but what about when you just need to get around the city? Especially at 4.30 when there's not a cab to be found anywhere. I asked Bernard to accompany me on some errands. politicians are so down on the pedicab drivers. They seem like pretty nice guys to me and there are not a lot of greener ways to get around the city. It's anyone's guess how many of them are actually going to register by the time the period ends on November 20th and what a little bit of regulation will actually do for the field. As for using pedicabs as just a way to get around town, well, it's more expensive than a taxi. It's about a dollar a block. And it's a lot more expensive than a subway, of course, but it's not as expensive as hiring a car and driver and it's kind of fun but the most fun of all is getting to drive one myself. Oh. No, no, no. You're not gonna fall. What are you doing? Betty cab driver kills Times reporter. Update at 11. <laughs> <laughs>